Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. This is the world of Mummy and Oscar B and today I've got a shopping haul for you. Um, I'm not getting a delivery tomorrow. This is what I've done today and I'll pop out in the week for top up fruit and veg and any milk or bread or anything like that as we need it. So today I have been, where haven't I been? I've been to Lidl and Aldi and Morrison's and Poundland and Home Bargains and I think that's it. Oh, and I popped in the one stop to pick up a bottle of Imto drink for me and Oscar. Um, and, oh, another loaf of bread. Forgot to add. And I also picked up some mushrooms. There we go. So, start with the one stop. Might as well. Picked up some mushrooms. These are one stop selected by Tesco. They sell a lot of Tesco products in there. Um, this used to be Tesco's bread. It's now their own, but it's just as nice. Uh, I can't remember how much it is. £1.5, I think. Don't quote me on that. Um, I've got bits and pieces from everywhere. So, let's start with whatever I pick up. It's not going to be shop to shop. It's going to be whatever I pick up. So, I've got Philadelphia. This came from Morrison's. It's £2.25 on offer at the moment for the family size. I have also got from Morrison's. I'm trying to group it together this is delicious i can't remember if i showed you last time but it's the options belgian chocolate praline flavor um it's two pound 25 in there at the moment and it is just like nutella it's just like nutella hot chocolate um what else did i get in more i found these and these tend to last a very long time so you can put them in a tub an airtight tub and they last quite a while so they are nice and soft these ones not like the tesco ones that are quite hard so we're gonna give those a go now and again if we fancy a bit of cake um morrison's morrison's i picked this up this was reduced from 90p to 45p it's just a drinking cup oscar likes these so picked that up for him Morrison's, Morrison's, Morrison's. I'm trying to think. I hadn't had any lunch, so I picked this up for lunch. Chunky pig in blanket rolls, and they're just like sausage rolls with bacon in them and a paprika pastry, and they are very, very nice. We're going to have the other one. Probably cut it in half for me and Oscar tomorrow for lunch, and I'll do like a snacky lunch with uh, cucumber, tomato, bits of cheese, some ham rolled up, that sort of thing. And trying to think what else I got from Morrison's. Carex. I've got two bottles of Carex. They are currently £1 each for that size, which is good value. I also picked up some baked, baking potatoes for when we have jacket potatoes next. I picked up a tub of roses for the Christmas box, but they've already gone away, so I can't show you those. Um, this is Aldi. I think that was it from Morrison's. If I come across anything else, I'll let you know. From Home Bargains, I got some batteries. I got three lots of AA and one lot of AAA because I've got a lot of AAA batteries already. Oh, Morrison's Huggies. A box of eight Huggies wipes. Don't know if you can see them. I'll show you them at the end. Um, let's move on. Home Bargains. Yeah, Home Bargains, yeah. <laughs> Orange Dime. I love these. They are all mine, just for me. I have air fryer liners for my dad because he wanted some of the silicon basket-like ones with the handles on them. My sister said that they burnt her hands, her fingers, when she tried to lift them up before. So I'm thinking these might be a suitable alternative. They were one forty-nine for the two of them. Home bargains. Uh, th this was Morrison's. Sorry, my might. Morrison's. <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, what else did I get? So that's that. Morrison's as well. I've got two... Excuse me. <laughs> Kevin. <laughs> two paninis there for dinner because I got some um, tempura chicken in Aldi. Uh, this is also more... I'm saying uh, Sorry, I'm just, uh, uh, quite a lot. Morrison's. They were reduced from £2 down to 50p because someone's ripped them open. I'm always up for cheap crisps because they always come in handy. Put some of this away. Put some of this away. What else have we got? Lidl. Went into Lidl just before I picked Oscar up and I got some bananas. I don't really eat bananas generally, but um, 
I am eating them at the moment because I'm quite quite enjoying one now and again. What else did I get from Lidl just now? Oh yeah, these. Thin cut potato fries because Oscar's been asking to try them for a while. So I've got those to go with our chicken paninis this evening. And I picked up some tuna and sweet corn deli filler for our jacket potatoes. There's two of those. One for me, one for Oscar. They didn't have any chicken ones, so I'll have to make do with the tuna. Home bargains. Juice burst. Just there. A big one. Apple juice, because Oscar's asked for a big bottle of juice burst, because he likes the juice burst apple juice. Um, moving back to Aldi, I've got still water, filtered milk some jersey milk i treat us to this at the weekend or it's equivalent so we have that with biscuits i've got some of this oscar generally has the robinson's one which is like two pounds something and this is one pound 19 and it's exactly the same so hopefully he'll like that i've got a lemon like fanta lemon dupe and a fanta fruit twist dupe I've got, of course, it would be Aldi if I didn't pick up the big cookie. Always got to have a big cookie. Um, so I've got one of those. I have also got, there's a tempura chicken that's going to go in our paninis this evening. And some bacon medallions. They're about £2.09, these ones, and I find them quite nice. Bacon medallions. What else did I get from? Oh, this was Lidl. Lazy cheese. <laughs> As Oscar calls it, lazy cheese. Aldi. Cumberland sausages. Oscar's into Cumberland sausages at the moment. So we have Cumberland sausages. We have cauliflower cheese. Frozen cauliflower cheese. Which is fast defrosting. It needs to go in the freezer. I also have... Festive pies. These are absolutely delicious. Going to have them on Sunday, I think, or maybe Monday. Um, beautiful. Much better than the puff of pies, the Lab Baby ones, so I hear. Might be wrong, but so I hear they are better than them. I've got some tree decorations. Kevin the Carrot ones to go on our tree. And I have... Well, I've bought myself a hat with a bobble on it's thermal it's fleece lined it's good for me 3.99 in aldi which is really really good i've got myself some brie because when oscar's out with his dad on sunday i will be having either ham and brie or bacon and brie sandwich um what else have we got chocolate malted milks just because i fancied some i've got some grapes two lots of strawberries some tomatoes blackberries mango chunks two lots of the this is seriously strong dupe with uh aldi but it doesn't have butter in it so it's good for me you've seen all of that these were from aldi as well i've got the apple crumbles we didn't actually eat the ones last week they went out of date before we remembered them <laughs> and sweet rhubarb because i'm sick of apple crumble so i've got rhubarb crumble for myself i'm gonna nip back to home bargains look at this little fella isn't he the sweetest he's got his earmuffs on his scarf on and to me it looks like a little cardigan that he's wearing but he's just so lovely he was two pound 49 and i just couldn't leave him there i had to bring him home with me so home he came we also have a north pole sign which was also from Home Bargains, and is two ninety nine, And those two are going to go on the Christmas display that we have. I picked up some Highland Spring drink, uh, fizzy water drinks from Home Bargains as well. They were marked at one sixty nine, but they came up at two sixty nine. So the manager let me have them for the price that I saw on display. These were from Aldi. Now, you can't have Christmas without these. Now, I, don't, I know I don't like butter. But I do love these. I always have Danish uh, traditional butter cookies. These were two ninety nine for three hundred and forty grams. There's no pictures of what they are, but I'm sure you all know what a Danish butter cookie looks like. If not, Google it. <laughs> Google will tell you everything. 
These are also from. Uh, these are from not also from. These are from Home Bargains. They're one ninety nine. You get about ten pieces in there, and they are for the Christmas box. I bought two of those because they are very very nice, and I may or may not open them for myself this weekend. I've got two of these from Home Bargains. These were actually reduced to fifty six p, but they only had a couple of boxes, so me and my sister got them. Never tried them before, but going to try them. Love a bit of Marmite. What else have we got? What have I forgotten? Toilet roll, Aldi. Kitchen roll, putting this away for Christmas. Last year, when I went in December to try and get this uh, kitchen roll, it's got it's got the snowman on it and the snow dog. Um, when I went in to get it last Christmas in December, I couldn't get it for love nor money anywhere. So I have picked that up to put away in the Christmas cupboard for next month. These are the wipes. Eight packs for £9, which I thought was really good. And... Oh, <laughs> I'm dropping everything. Another loaf of... Ho, 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 this. Nailed it. Ho, 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 this. And that... It's pretty much it. I don't think there was anything else. As I say, there was, there was the roses, the tub of roses, but I've already put that in the cupboard, so I can't show you that, but I'm sure you all know what they look like. Um, that's all my shopping today. I don't even know what I spent. I spent, I know I spent 57 57 in Aldi because I thought, oh, that's <laughs> random, 57 57 um, The rest of it was just bits and pieces, £15, £20. But, yeah, that is the main shop for this we can there isn't much by way of meat products we still have the burgers and the meatballs left over from last week we also have the, the sausage meat and the pastry left over from last week i'm actually going to do something with that tomorrow um hence the mushrooms because i'm going to try and make sausage meat and mushroom pasta but i'm also going to make maybe mini sausage rolls for lunch to go with lunch who knows i'll try something uh so yeah that's that's basically it i hope you're all well hope you've had a good week weekend again now yay no more school runs it's been absolutely dreadful here with the weather the rain the wind the buses cancelling at last minute notice and oscar was late for school twice because of it Oh, excuse me. I am absolutely shattered today. So, yeah, he's been late for school twice because of the buses cancelling at the last minute. And once there was two in a row cancelled. And you just think, you know, like, I pay for bus tickets on the school run. So other people do as well and they pay their bus fares all day long and what are we paying for because the service is abysmal so stagecoach they won't be but stagecoach if you are watching this by random chance one of you might have picked it up one of the top execs do something about your bus service because people need to get to work and people need to get to school and college etc etc and you cannot get places on time because the buses don't run to time you need to put other buses on to cope so if one bus is running like the other day there was one hour between two main number one buses you should have put on another service between then so that there wasn't an hour wait between the two there should have been another bus allocated from the depot to take up the slack when the other one was running late so yes that's my little moan there to stagecoach oscar is here he's in the front room um can you shout hi He's watching Horrid Henry. He didn't really want to do this um, shopping haul today, and that's fine. He's he's had a bit of a rough week at school. I'm not quite sure what's going on. I'm a, he's got a new teacher starting Monday, and I think that may be causing some anxieties because he's he's not met her, the new teacher, and she's going to be doing Mondays and Tuesdays, and then his regular Wednesday, Thursday, Friday teacher is still going to be there so i think it may be upsetting the apple cart as we say and he's been a bit off sorts this week so that's why he hasn't joined in with this shopping haul however i hope you still found it interesting um somebody did ask if i could do shopping hauls on my own <laughs> no i won't be doing them on my own unless oscar doesn't want to join in um 
and that's fine if he doesn't like today so i hope you've enjoyed this particularly and oh excuse me i'm also really sorry someone did ask me to mention prices and i don't think i've been doing that at all i don't think i've mentioned many prices apart from the danish cookies and the huggies wipes the snowman kitchen roll was two pounds something which is expensive but i love a snowman kitchen roll at christmas um they also make a snowman toilet roll but somehow i think it's wrong to wipe your bum with the snowman hmm you with me or not <laughs> so yeah hope you enjoyed this haul i'm gonna go and put it all away and get us some dinner and i will see you for the next one which will be during the week when i've picked up a few bits and pieces if there's anything to show um if not then it will be next weekend take care bye <laughs>